Good morning, everyone. This is Hug Zulu, the mad scientist, coming at you from this miniature freaking dungeon in this Let's Play Terraria 1.3 series. I don't know why I'm talking so slow. In the previous episode, I forgot what the heck we were doing because I went to I went to bed. I went to bed, so yeah. Um, and in this episode. We're going to attempt to get our freaking behinds into the underworld. Because we need to rescue one of our friends, said the slime. And that is, of course, the very wise but very short-tempered imp. If that is so, then we have to get to work. There's no time to waste. The swarm has been summoned. We are ready to go. Ta 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 ta. Now let's see. Where do we want to go? Obviously, we want to go straight down there. We saw a lot of spooky things down there. I do want to take a look more at the the ice caves, but I just don't think we're gonna have the time for that. So let's just let's just head right on down, shall we? But we need to make an obsidian tower kind of house for the new NPCs that come our way. I still need to get the painter. The painter is taking a while, and so is the party girl. But the party girl, I mean, come on. We expected her to take forever. She's the party girl. Regardless. This is totally fine. Um, hmm. I see the golden horseshoe in my inventory. Or in my, uh, you know... Oh, you know what? Hmm. This thing works even if it's in our, if it in, yeah even if it's our, in our inventory. Okay, in that case, we can uh, just go ahead and uh, yeah do that. Can't even see it. Can you can you see this? Kind of. I was coloring our little. Oh hey hey hello. Silly granite elemental. He used to be so tough, but now he's next to useless. It kind of makes me laugh. Anyway. We are now immune to fall damage. Hooray. Let's just go jump off all the cliffs and see what happens. Mm, I really want to pick up that lime kelp. I really want to get as much rainbow dye as possible, but... Oh, hello. You can't kill me, Medusa. I have minions, which are immune to your evil spell of evil. Darn it, I'm not taking fall damage. That's great. You know what, let's cut in through that little... That mushroom cavern over there. We want to get as many openings as possible for this kind of thing. Especially when we're talking about... You know... Hard mode. Hard mode is going to be very difficult to get around because every corner is going to bring you more pain and more misery. We can't have that. Do, 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 do. Okay, I tried. Oh. Background changed for like two seconds. I swear I'll be right down there. Ooh, that's a pretty gem cave, but we're going to have to come back for it later. Gosh, there's a lot of stuff in there. But yeah, we'll come back later. For now, we need to get straight down here. Man, I love this music. Ooh, that was a crawdad for some reason. And that is a lot of tungsten. Are you sure there's no detonators nearby? Those things scare me. Oh! I might explain it. I wonder if large amounts of ore spawn near traps. Wait, what was that sound? Crawled out again. Does he even drop anything special? It doesn't look like it. But who knows? Every monster serves their purpose. Somehow. Oh, hello. I'm dodging all the traps today. Ooh, this is a mushroom cabin. 
You do not see that every day. And it has a mushroom chest and everything. Awesome. Awesome. That's going to be very helpful for when we actually go to build the truffles home. It's annoyingly difficult to take care of most of the time. We've almost killed our 100th cave batch, which means we're going to get the banner pretty darn soon. We're probably just, just going to hang it up in that cavern. That is a beetle. Get over there and kill the beetle. Right, I don't even know why I did that. There's my 100th cave bat. Just as expected. Okay, we don't want to go in there. Even though there is a heart crystal. Well, I mean, maybe. Maybe we want to go in there. Who knows? There is a granite golem. We shall now take care of the granite golem. I like how smart he is. But, not smart enough. Actually, no, he's smart. He's just not strong enough. Okay, what do we got? Eh, sus suspicious looking eye. We don't need it, but we'll take it anyway, because that's just how we do things. Just because, oh, gosh darn it, our inventory is like almost full, which is kind of spooky. We, we literally just got here. We're not even at our destination yet, and we're running out of space. Maybe we want to hold the mushrooms inside this chest for now. Yeah. Stone block. We'll think about it. I mean, we did make a lot of meteorite bricks back there. In the previous episode, that was. Oh yeah, that's what we were doing in the previous episode. Making a meteorite house. And darn it, it was so freaking cool. Oh hey. I want that worm. Give me the worm. Dun, dun. I really sh oh. Okay. Okay, then. There's a lot of interesting things that I could be doing here. If such is the case... Let me go inside this little granite cabin. Wow, that is a pretty bookshelf. Gravitation potions? We don't need them. Yeah, well, we don't need them. But we will take the gold coins and the torches. Danger sense? Why not? Healing potions? Definitely. Can't have too many of those in hard mode. And that looks like it. Alright. Don't want to spend too much time here though. We are not supposed to be hanging around in the, inside this little cave. Inventory is filling up with ropes. How original. Okay, I'm not gonna go any further. Oh wait! Hey, hello! Hey! You see that? That's obsidian! We're gonna need some obsidian later. Uh oh. So we almost died. That's always fun. Hey, hey, get, get, st stop. Get up here. Hmm, okay. Oh gosh darn it, another mushroom biome. We will take care of it later. Just don't have the time for anything else right now. Let's go. It's 20 obsidian for each piece of that strange obsidian armor. I kind of want to wear it for the vanity purposes. It looks really cool. Not only that, but... We kind of, uh... We're going to need a lot of that stuff. At least 17 extra for our... Um, crafting the hexstone bars. Yeah. Ow. That, there's a golem up there. Alright. No problem, there's a golem. These guys are so smart, I love it. Man. This could be scary, though, to see what other granite monsters lie in wait in hard mode. That is going to be the scary part. I slap this thing down. Ta-da. Okay. 
I would hope we never accidentally uh, get rid of this thing. Because we need it a lot. How much is this? 109? Eh, a little bit more. I don't know how much we'll need. Okay. We could um, go for the Molten Pickaxe as well, but I also want the Reaver Shark, and I like the Reaver Shark. I like it more, actually. But I'm just not sure. Because then we'll be fishing in the ocean for crates, and then do we open up the crates then? Or do we wait until hard mode to just fill ourselves up with instant hard mode ores? That, that kind of just cuts out many hours of mining time. No way we can get back over. Oh, hey! Orange blood root. We don't see that every day. We need it. Okay, we found a little shortcut-ish kind of thing. We'll just go back to the way we came. I know it's not exactly a shortcut, per se. But, I mean, it works, right? The longest shortcut. One of the worst levels in Rayman 3. Can we actually dig down through here? We could. Yeah, we could. Let's do that. Ah, such calming music. There appears to be something more down here. I mean, it's not a lie, given that. But, you know. Yeah, there's definitely gonna be a shortcut up here because there's a really large cave we have not yet explored in that direction. Wow, my minions are just floating around me. They got my back. I have a lot of respect for them. They're like, they're more than just my friends. They're like my brothers. Yes. My perfect brothers. It's strange, Hugthulu thought. He was only here for research once upon a time, but it seems like he's here for some sort of different purpose. Whatever purpose that may be, he might not know yet. Besides just to hug people. But what did Slime mean by that? To hug people. I mean, he always did like hugs, even though it wasn't his name. Alright. We are now inside the gosh darn depths of the underworld. Oh wait, no, that's right. The underworld has a brand new background, so they made this, the old background, into like the right above heck kind of background. Spooky. Very spooky. We want to be careful. We don't want to drop and die and melt in the lava. Oh, hey. Oh, yeah, that's right. There was, a uh, Kevin up here. Excuse me. Coming through. We were up here, right? Right. Yeah, we didn't want to go down here because there was so much... Or just too many heck backgrounds. The lava veins were scaring us. Anyway. Hmm. Alright. Down here we go. Dun, dun. Oh gosh, too fast. Too fast. This is making me uncomfortable. Oh, spider cave. Good grief. Someone help me out, please. What the heck is all that glowy stuff? I want to know. Oh, hey, spider chest. It's just a web slinger. We'll take it, but we don't need it. Too 
too many glow sticks at this point. Hmm. Well, we saw it earlier, but let's just dig into this real quick just to see what the heck it is. Maybe it's useful for something. They look like fire blossoms, really. Are they fire blossoms? It doesn't look like they do anything. But they still glow, so that's always cool. Anyway. Yeesh. Ow. 72 damage and I'm on fire. I'm on fire! Okay, now that is getting spooky. So many new sounds. What even is this place? Huxley was starting to feel the heat inside of his um, dinosaur skull thing. There was only one way that he could get to the bottom of this, and that was to literally get to the bottom of this. And then cue the epic action music. Save the worm. Oh jeez. Oh crud, there it is. There is the underworld. Is that a bone serpent? I bet a bone serpent's already on our tail. Bone tail, what's cracking, buddy? Did he even drop anything important? Just coins. 12 silver coins, but it's still kind of a lot, but whatever. Holy crud, this place looks beautiful. I'm living the trailer, guys! Holy crud! That demon looks angry. Worm, no, don't do it! Okay. Hornet killed him instead. That's totally fine. Ready for this, guys? This is your destiny, said the slime. Go right ahead. Do not fear, for we have your back. We are the resistance, said the hornets, and we shall keep you protected with the power of the swarm. Now go, and rescue our comrade. Then it shall be done, said Hugthulu, and he dove right in without a second thought. Let's listen to this music while we're at it. Ooh. breath away. Where is this friend of yours? said Hugthulu. 
He has been sealed deep within the power of the Imp Staff. The Imp Staff, he said. Where would I find that? It only appears to those who can wield the power of the Hexstone. The Hexstone? Why in the world? In other words, you have to craft it. Oh, okay. I got too many torches at this point. There's a fire imp right there. Is that our friend? Oh, no it is not. Those are among many of the corrupted imps. Maybe not the corrupted that you're thinking of, but... It's definitely there. Gosh, the lava glows. It's so pretty. Ow. I need an obsidian skin potion fast. I don't want all these darn bombs here either. I'll drink the thorns potion. Go slime. Mess him up. Hmm. How many hexstone ores do I need? As it appears, to make sure that that to make a good how do you say message to discourage the resistance. The corrupted masters of the underworld took the imp staff and melted it, dissolved it into the lava, be becoming part of the land. It has to be remade. And only you can do that, Hugthulu. I see. I'll do my best. Gosh darn, uh, you know. What's the word I'm looking for? Shadow chest while we're at it. Uh oh. That's a very angry looking demon. about it. Every creature in the underworld is possessed by the most aggressive negative energy. How can we hope to purify such a place? All you need is hugs. Are you, are, are you kidding me? No, Hug Lulu. I am not kidding. But I'm pretty sure that they'll set me on fire if I even tried. Does not matter. Courage is the important thing. Hmm. Only if you insist. It seems like most of the underworld is already like lit up. Because of the background. Hey, look, shadow chest. Yeah, we don't have to worry about lighting up the darn place all the time. What do we got? What the heck? That's a new weapon. Ooh, this, there's the obsidian skin. Great, great, great. Lazy heckwing bow. 21 rage damage. Put an arrow is turning to flaming bats. That's great. It's just like the bee's knees. You know, for some reason the bees need is stronger. I don't know why. Okay, it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Let's get rid of the bombs. Does this thing shoot well? 
Oh darn, that would explain it. I, I get to shoot bats, basically. Bro. Bo. I'm sorry. That's great. 25 platinum bars. I can summon another king slime with that, but do I need it? I don't know. I'll take this anyway. Oh, darn it. Come on. Goodbye, Granite. So with, I'm, I can practically summon bats now. You could say that you might have even freed some of our three flying friends. It was the imp, however, that matters the most. I should probably dive straight into the lava and begin excavating immediately. That would be a good choice, Hakula. We just need to find a suitable, large enough lava space. Alright. It shall be done. If hugs are in peril, it is my sworn duty. these aggressive creatures. Who possessed them to be this way anyway? None other than the ultimate ancient evil. Oh, not even we stand a chance against him. No, no, we need... We need the resistance to be complete in order for that to even have a chance. I'm gonna go ahead and drink up this obsidian skin potion. We don't have all day. starting to make me dizzy. If I ever teleported back to home right now, I would probably become very disoriented because of the amount of red that I'm seeing. And suddenly, nothing but blue and green. Hmm. We do have the Hexforge now, right? Yes, we do. Ah, there's the bottom of the world. I bet there's an achievement for that, just like the one where I was in orbit. I'm gonna blast you into orbit, you stupid mutt. Bone tail! Here he comes. Why have you even dropped anything important at this point? I'm assuming not. Rock bottom. When you're at rock bottom, said the slime, the only way you can go is up. Wise words, my friends. Wise words. How much hexed do we have now? I cannot see very well. 122? That's definitely enough for the imp staff. want to keep mining. That's why I'm not really sure what to do. Oh, 
Ooh, fire blossoms look pretty good when they're in full bloom. Very pretty, yes. And yet, throughout all of this, the little bouncy heart followed without question. How cute. Fire blossom seeds are now a thing. Maybe they always were, but I just didn't. Couldn't tell. Can I get can I get on, on lava with this thing? That would be cool if I could. I am the best, you know that? Treading lava like a boss. Ooh. This is how you explore the underworld, my friends. None of that silly business. What we want to do is complete this side of the underworld. If we can. Oh jeez, what the heck is happening here? Uh oh. Suddenly I am dying. Whew. Okay. Well we know darn well we're not going to do that again. It better not be another shadow chest in there somewhere. That would suck. <sighs> I think it's too dangerous to continue. We might want to head home while we still can. Okay. We did it. We made it out in one piece. Lesser healing potions. We had those for like all this time. Okay then. Gold coins. see here. Let's replace the furnace with the heck forge because you know it's super cool. Yeah. Awesomeness. Great. Now what can we make? Make the molten gear. There's our imp staff. There's a molten pickaxe. Molten fury. Not, a, not like we need that. We have a freaking we have a fire bat bow. That looks like it. Alright. Imp staff. Go! A masterful imp staff. Oh my gosh. That's great. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. Now, let's freaking summon this dude. Imp, I free you from your eternal prison. Ooh. Now, if only he didn't replace the slime. Let's, let's do this in a cool way, right? Right? Slime. Hornet Swarm. Imp. And now, just just for fun zores, some of the Eye for Zulu. Show us your power, great and mighty Imp. <laughs> it's great. I love it. I'm loving it. Uh oh, now he's mad. He still hurts. Wow. And it's done. Very good work, guys. Good stuff. Mm, bunny fish. I'll have to get that already. Anyway. Selling all this. Well, most of it anyway. Good, 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 good. This is great. Our full... Free hard mode summoner loadout is complete. And it makes me very happy. 
I wonder, what else can I make with this stuff? Anything that I'm missing in particular? Oh yeah, the drill containment unit. Well, we have another piece of that puzzle. <laughs> this is epic. Should we hold off on the molten pickaxe though? Do we need it? I don't know yet if we do. Do we want it? Or do we want the reaper shark? I honestly want the reaper shark, but, you know. We have all these bars to spare, and, uh, you know. Miner for five? Oh, okay. So that there's an achievement for that. That's fine, then. Yeah. Goodbye, night. De Deathbringer pickaxe. We need to bring our meteorite bars into the freaking, you know, UFO. What's up, Clovier? Nothing new? That's fine. Man, this place is looking great. I'm so happy. It appears that we did not even have time for introductions, said the Fire Imp. Allow me to introduce myself. Well, Aklu interrupted. I already know who you are. You're, you're the masterful Fire Imp. Indeed I am. But, I like to set things on fire. Oh, I, but I knew that too, said Octavio. Either way, I'm glad to finally be free. I will show this underworld, my own people, what happens when you mess with one of their own kind. That sounds dangerous. Are you sure we should be fighting back? I mean, who knows, what if we're the bad guys? And they're the good guys. Nonsense, everyone shouted. We need to bring this world back to its pure form, like the way it used to be. Alright then. I trust your judgment. And so, the judgment was trusted. Let's, uh... Let's look at this obsidian armor thing. Take ten silk each. Okay. We'll just now take a lot of cobwebs, but no problem. Thirty silk total, right? Okay, easy. And so you put this in there. Let's get rid of the silk blocks while we can. That's a lot of freaking ores. We can uh, put some of that away. We don't need these. So tell me about this Obsidian Outlaw stuff. It looks really darn cool. Oh wait, did I put away? No, no I didn't. Okay, never mind. Oh wait, we, we make the Obsidian Armor at the Loom, which is very strange. That's not something you would expect. And it's white rarity. That's very strange. Is there a set effect? I want to I wanna test out the set effect, but I'm just kind of too afraid to get rid of my minions right now. Wow, what the heck? I look so weird. Well, I mean, it is an outlaw hat. It makes sense. What about the long coat? Does it look better than my epic scientist coat? It looks more like a jacket than a coat. Or maybe it is a coat. Hmm, what about the pants? You can, you can really hardly tell. Well, regardless. Hmm. Well, minions, it's been great, but for right now, I want to test this stuff out. You guys can just go spread out, do whatever you want. Okie dokie. Hmm. Let's see what I can do with this. Is there a set effect? There's no set effect. It's just... Obsidian armor. With five defense each. That's very strange. No, wait, four defense for the pants. And for the hat, never mind. Mm. Peculiar. I'll go ahead and put these back on. Hmm, 
Do I keep the bee's knees? I like it a lot, but I still have the bee gun. Hmm. I just don't know. Either way, I'm probably gonna do something about this obsidian stuff. I'll just put it up here. It looks cool this way, right? Yeah. It's like a little scarecrow. What I do for the fossil greaves? Who knows? Let's put him right there. Do we need this guide to plant fiber cordage or whatever? I might just sell one. Maybe. It is a really good early game item for ropes. You know what? I'll just... I'll sell one. Wow, it's already worth one gold. A really good um, source of gold, I might say, for early game. Hmm. See, we still have the obsidian. I mean, we don't really need it anymore. But we're going to stuff it into the loot chest anyway. Explosives can go you know where. The shadow chest. Yeah, we'll have to make an obsidian tower pretty darn soon. Invisibility potion. Why do we... Why would I even want this? That's very strange. Ash block. Is this useful for anything yet? Nope. Still for arid... Arid... Iridescent... Iridescent bricks. Whatever. I don't even know. Time to reforge. Oh wait. I'll just we'll do it later. Well not that, but you know what I mean. Lazy. You call that lazy? Murderous! Oh that's great. And now it's super duper awesome. It's kinda like a summoner. I wanna say it's a summoner item even though it's ranged. It would be cool, though. Freaking Hecbat items. For a minion. I'm wasting arrows. Let's let's try to keep our stuff to a minimum. Hmm. I'm so proud we got the Imp Staff. The Web Slinger is just meh. We don't need it. And it's the shortest range grapple hook in the game. But at the same time, you can split up into eight little... Eight arms, so... Just what the doctor ordered, for the most part. Stone blocks, why do I still have you in here? Let's look at today's fishing quest. We'll just do that, and then that'll be the end of this episode. Sky Lakes! Haha! -ha. We can do that now. Alright. I'm ready. Slime! Hornets! Imp! Are we ready to take to the skies? Because I sure am. Yippee! And stuff. Man, look at that imp fly. It's so majestic. And we're losing altitude. Darn it. Doesn't matter. Let's try again. Green Hornet just isn't feeling it today, is he? Hmm. Let's try again. There's the Sky Lake. It's so pretty. Gosh darn. I wish I could freaking be here more often. It's really pretty. Anyway. Slime Mount, where are ya? Show me the fishing magic and stuff. 
It's almost impossible to tell if your line is moving. There's our angelfish. That was quick. Hello, I'm here. Ta-da, I got one gold and some sonar potion. <laughs> sonar. Dun, dun, dun. I need to show this guy. Yeah. What, are the, what are these strange plans he's talking about anyway? Anyway, orange die. I wonder if we should die our slime. Oh, we don't need to. Nah, there's no need for that. Forceful the bee's knees. That's just that's a great name. Let's just show some random things. Uh, moon glow, fire blossom, and death weed. Yeah, sure. Are these strange enough for you, Mr. Die Trader? They better be. No? Darn it. I, I don't know. I, I do not understand anything. Anyway. It was great. I, I thoroughly enjoyed this episode. I'm very, very happy with the result. We don't need this magic missile, do we? No. Alright, buddies. This has been Hugthulu. Slime. Uh, Hornets. Imp. Heart. And baby face monster. And sometimes a Crimera. Playing Terraria 1.3. And we will see you in the next freaking episode. Goodbye, my friends.